thing first Friday, a long-standing tradition here in the Valley that tonight came with a brand new message. Thanks for joining us here at 11. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. For the very first time, Friday, first Friday went a bit political. 8 News Now reporter Sasha Loftus spent all evening there. Joins us now live with more on that message. Well, good evening, Denise and Brian. You can see the first Friday of 2020 is finally winding down. It came with what you would normally expect, a lot of food, fun, music, and some shopping. But it also came with a completely new political message this year. Get out, use your voice, and vote. The first Friday of 2020. And then the weather's not bad at all. Roar through Las Vegas. With food, fun, music, and a few unusual friends. <laughs> but this particular event also came with a political twist. To really get a chance to mix having fun with politics, which is a beautiful thing. Campaign leaders for Senator and Presidential Candidate Bernie Sanders took part to share their message. You are a battleground state and you know this. While supporters encouraged everyone to get out and vote this year. The Nevada caucus is coming up and it's really important to engage voters now to pick a candidate, pick a candidate early and really volunteer and rally around them. And they hope their efforts to engage with our local community will inspire others to get involved. The arts and music have always been at the core of a social movements, right? And this is where the people are. All while they enjoy the excitement. This is a beautiful sight, a beautiful gathering of people from all walks of life. This one of a kind community atmosphere has to offer. I just hope it gets bigger and bigger every year. Now back out here live, the first chance to vote here locally in our state is the Nevada caucus. That happens February 22nd of this year, just a little over a month away. Then, of course, the general presidential election. That's later this year on November 3rd. Rewarding live downtown, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now.